Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you a new stand I just built. And I built this stand based on the designs by Barry Howell of Howell Custom Coatings. Barry has uh, been contacting me through the Man Crafting page on Facebook and we've been discussing powder coating and different issues and different ideas for doing things better. And he's just been a great sounding board. Uh, he's given me a lot of great ideas and hopefully I've been able to uh, inspire him a little bit as well. But today I'm going to show you, uh, he developed this stand for powder coating the Yeti Ramblers and it will work for both the 18, the 36 and the 64 ounce bottles. And I'm going to pull this off here. And as you can see, this one's adjustable and I've got I want to say it's a two and a half inch. Yeah, it's a two and a half inch washer on the top and bottom. And the inside diameter on them is smaller. I think this one is a three quarter inch inside diameter and this one's a half inch inside diameter washer. And what I did is I slid this one over and welded it here. I welded this three quarter inch tubing to just a piece of plate steel, welded the washer in place and of course the half inch fits perfect inside this tubing and then I welded this half inch by two and a half inch washer to the top and then the only other thing I had to do is to make this adjustable is just use this little screw here to loosen and tighten this little key uh, for different heights and in the lowest position it's going to work great for the 18 ounce rambler next level up is a 36 ounce and then if you if you're smart you can put little marks on there so you'll know exactly where to go and that's the perfect height for the Yeti 64 ounce Rambler and so when this slides down over the lip of this is just about even with this washer and when you're powder coating the great thing is even when I'm down here getting close to this lip on the mouth no powder is going up inside and I have a feeling it has something to do with the Faraday effect that the powder just doesn't want to go to that area and that that occurs when you're doing small parts where there's a lot of creases and things so I'm guessing that that I'm getting the similar sort of uh, impact on here as well but anyway I wanted to show this to you so if uh, you were in a position where you're going to be doing some of the ramblers that you'd have the option of building this nice stand as well uh, also I just wanted to give a shout out to Barry I'm gonna uh, probably post a few pictures that he's uh, sent me of ramblers that he's done I'm talking just they're amazing they look so cool and if you're in the Savannah area definitely check out Hal custom coatings on Facebook I'm sure Barry would be happy to uh, help you with your powder coating needs in that area again thanks for watching this video I hope you're having a great day make sure you like subscribe and if you have any comments take time to make a comment i try to answer everybody that takes time to uh, watch my videos so have a great day